Mayor Mayor Hancock here. We're coming at you from East High School where I just spoke to the students who are participating in the Simmons Foundation basketball camp. Every year we're proud to partner with the Simmons Foundation as they do a basketball camp for our young people here in the city of Denver. Good job to my friend Alberta Simmons and the, the Simmons Foundation on the work they did this week with our young people. I'm with my man Cody. Cody belongs to uh, Alberta Simmons and Cody's hanging out with me today. I just said come on and be a star Cody. Look at him. He's ready. He's ready. But happy summer. Say happy summer to everyone, Cody. <laughs> Thank you, Cody. Listen, Denver, we're so proud to be coming at you for this Friday Mail with the Mayor. And we got a couple things we want to talk to you about. First of all, we want to send deepest condolences to the Bowling family and loved ones for the loss of Pat Bowling, the beloved owner of our Denver Broncos, who passed away this week at the age of 75. This is a big loss to all of us here in Bronco country. Uh, Pat Bowling was someone who gave me a job when I was just 17 years old and gave me an opportunity to be with the Denver Broncos as we traveled to Los Angeles for the Super Bowl against the New York Giants. But more than anything, Pat Bowling meant so much to all of us and helped to revive really this wonderful, wonderful football team in the life of our city and really put our city, our state, and our region on the map. He will be dearly missed. And again, our prayers for comfort and for peace go out to the entire Bolin family and to Bronco country uh, following the loss of the great uh, Pat Bolin. We're going to go on. I want you to know on Tuesday we also announced that Denver is receiving a quarter of a million dollar grant from Coca-Cola Foundation to fund an effort to get Denverites to recycle more. Come on, Denver. We're now at 23%. We lag behind the national average of 34%. And we do everything we can to boost our recycling percentages here in the city of Denver. And I want to thank those uh, folks who have gotten involved and helped Denver kind of help us to raise the percentage of folks who are recycling this city of Denver by 34%. We got to do much better than that. We got to get past the national average of 34% so that we can uh, continue to say we're one of the best in the country in everything that we do. So join me. If you're not recycling today, call 311. Order one of those recycling bins and have it, re re uh, have it delivered to your home. Um, we also got a letter recently from Thomas Corson, who wants to know how to get access to recycling and composting at his apartment building in Lowry. And Thomas, um, he wrote this letter to me. He says, I live in a large facility with food service and lots of paper that evidently goes into landfills. Can you look into this, please? And uh, I want to thank Thomas for writing in. Thomas, we have been working on this for quite some time. As you know, Denver is currently at 23%, as I just said, in terms of our recycling. If we're going to get better, we got to find a way to include our multifamily housing units in recycling and composting. Uh, right now, Denver Public Works does recycling for multifamily units at seven units or below. We don't go any higher than that because we simply don't have the equipment or the manpower to, to uh, recycle or pick up recycling. Those private apartment units are responsible for setting up recycling on their own, but we are working to see how we can do better. Right now, if you want to recycle, I want you to know there is a drop-off location. It is the Cherry Creek drop-off location located at 7352 Cherry Creek Drive in Denver. It's free, no cost. You can bring recycling there and drop it off. If you want to learn more about it, go to denvergov.org slash Denver Recycles and join our recycling movement here in the city of Denver. I want to thank you all for joining us today. That's all we have time for this Friday. I want to thank my man Cody. And again, thank the Simmons family, Alberta Simmons, and the Simmons Foundation for having us out once again to hang out with the young people who are part of the Simmons Foundation Basketball Leadership Camp. Y'all take care. Have a great weekend. We'll see you next week and enjoy the first day of summer.